students uh, now we are going to learn about uh, the mechanism of feeding in frog we have learned the digestive system and associated digestive glands in the previous uh, sessions so now we just learn about the we will discuss about the mechanism of feeding as you know frog is a carnivorous animal you know carnivorous means they are flesh eating animals so frog feeds on crustaceans insects worms and spiders frog prey ne capture eynadu valare interesting aayittulla oru kaaichiyana because the prey is captured with its tongue so the method of catching is peculiar on finding the prey within reach the frog opens the mouth and quickly strikes the prey with its tongue the prey adheres to the tongue because the tongue is very sticky and then that uh, tongue is suddenly withdrawn and the mouth is closed oru preyine kaanumbo valare pettanu thane adinte tongue porthekku idugeyum adinte aa sticky aayittulla tongue aayidond aa prey adil adhere igeyum cheyum endu valare rapid aayitta tongue avuthottittu preyine swallow cheyum so that is the uh, capturing method of frog Uh, you know the um, peculiar features of uh, frog's tongue adu nammal digestive system il adu detail la ta kandadana because its anterior end is only attached to the buccal cavity but the posterior end of the tongue is free and at the same time the posterior end has two lobes that's why we are calling the tongue as bifid tongue so the movement of the tongue is amazingly rapid in frog it can be flicked out and withdrawn in about 1/10th of a second athra samaye vendu its attachment at the anterior end of the buccal cavity enables it to be projected to some distance from the mouth that it is happening in the case of small prey and large grey the large prey that is gripped with the jaws and its escape is prevented by backwardly directed teeth present along the margin of the upper jaw uh, as you know the function of teeth in frog that is not meant for chewing it is simply helps the frogs to hold the prey without slipping it and then the prey is swallowed without the mastication appo adana nammal parrathu teeth are not meant for chewing chewing nu varana oru process avade illa in the case of frog the process of chewing is not happening in the buccal cavity but the teeth are present alle um, uh, teeth are present in the upper jaw and vomerine teeth this teeth are meant uh, not for chewing it just helps to hold the prey without slipping so the prey is swallowed without any mastication <clears throat> the swallowing is brought about by upward pressure of the throat downward pressure of the eyeballs and peristalsis in the esophagus so this swallowing nu varna process ne help cheyina moonu factors aanu ullathu chewing chavacharakkadiyan idu swallow cheyanadu so some other forces helps the frog to uh, swallow that food to the pharynx or to the esophagus which are the three factors first one upward pressure of the throat second one downward pressure of eyeballs and which are followed by peristalsis in the esophagus and the mucus secreted by the mucus glands in the buccopharyngeal cavity uh, that that lubricates the food to assist to the swallowing as you know namukku ee prey swallow cheyanengil adin oru 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 slimy character venam adu slip cheythu vilingi povana അപ്പോൾ അതിനാണ് മ്യൂക്കസ് ഗ്ലാൻസിൽ നിന്ന് ബക്കോ ഫാരിഞ്ചിയൽ ക്യാവിറ്റിയിലുള്ള മ്യൂക്കസ് ഗ്ലാൻസ് മ്യൂക്കസ് സെക്രീറ്റ് ചെയ്യും സോ ദാറ്റ് മ്യൂക്കസ് ഹെൽപ്സ് ദ ഫ്രോക്ക് ടു സ്വാളോ ദ പ്രേ വിത്തൗട്ട് എനി മാസ്റ്റിക്കേഷൻ ഓക്കെ ആൻഡ് സോ ആൻഡ് ആഫ്റ്റർ ദാറ്റ് സ്വാളോയിങ് വെൻ ദ ഫുഡ് റീച്ചസ് ദ സ്റ്റോമക്ക് ഡൈജഷൻ വിൽ സ്റ്റാർട്ട് ദ ഡൈജഷൻ ബിഗിൻസ് ഇൻ ദ സ്റ്റോമക്ക് and the digestion process continues in the duodenum also i hope you know duodenum is the uh, part of the small intestine 
and the digestion process that is completed in the next part of the small intestine that is ileum. So digestion begins in the stomach and it uh, completed in the ileum. And after digestion absorption should occur. This absorption also occurs in the ileum. What about the undigested food particles? The rest of the food particle, no? Uh, the undigested uh, parts of the food that pass into the rectum. Here, water is absorbed from the waste, waste matter and then we changes into dark semi-solid fecus. So, this fecus is finally expelled out through the cloaca and cloacal aperture. This is only the uh, mechanism of uh, feeding in frog. Thank you.